Hi guys, it's Jonathan from Smart Home Sounds, a home audio visual retailer based in the UK. Hope you're all doing well. As summer is fast approaching and it's looking like the rain is finally easing up, we cannot wait for more opportunities to bring the music outdoors. That's why this video will cover our top recommendations for outdoor audio, catering for all different budgets. And of course it's only right that I dress appropriately for the occasion. There you go, much better. So we're going to break this down into portable speakers, wired options and wireless options with a few favourites in each category. So if you want any more personal advice and you're based in the UK, our customer service team are always here to help, whether that's by email, live chat or by picking up the phone. If you find this video helpful, it would be great if you could subscribe to our channel if you haven't already for more shirts and content like this. So we're going to kick things off with wired options, which are the best for more permanent setups. In general, these options are all suitable from small patio areas up to medium to large outdoor spaces. By wired, permanent options means we're referring to either wall-mounted speakers, ceiling speakers or other fixed solutions. They usually require an amp and speaker cable and more of a professional installation. Budget-wise, you're looking at around £800 and above, but the solutions are designed to be there all year round, ready whenever you need them. Don't worry, we will be covering more affordable solutions later on in the video. First up are wall-mounted speakers that are powered by the Sonos amp for £599. Now, I'm really sorry these speakers are all boxed up at the moment, only because they're all brand new, and if we put them on clearance, there'd be nothing but outdoor speakers in the clearance section, so apologies. Now, we're only using the Sonos amp as an example, as it is the most popular option for powering passive speakers, but there are slightly cheaper options available, so this is just a guide. So our top recommendation would be the Bowers & Wilkins AM1 outdoor speakers, which are available for £499 pounds per pair. These come in both black and white and are our installer's favourites. Many people opt for these for their simplicity of install and their performance per pound. Alternatively, we also recommend the Sonos outdoor speakers if you have a bigger budget as they have an RRP of $799 a pair. Now these are great for pairing with the Sonos amp and sticking with the Sonos ecosystem if you are a Sonos fan. Now these only come in white so that is something to consider in terms of aesthetics. If you are after black, the AM ones that I just mentioned look visually similar to the Sonos outdoor speakers. If you've got maybe a smaller patio area and you're conscious of the sound performance being too imposing, we would recommend the Kef Venturers which start at £239 a pair for the Ventura 4s or the Monster Audio Climate Range which, start, which starts at £305 a pair for the climate 50s. You can step up to the monitor audio vectors which are a popular option for £275 per speaker. Now these offer flexible mounting options and are great for mounting in a corner under a soffit or you can put a pair of them in the middle of the wall. If you're a fan of Bose you could also consider their 251 environmental speakers available for £499.95 a pair designed to provide a wide sound performance in large outdoor areas and withstand even the harshest English weather. Moving away from wall-mounted speakers, we've also seen customers install outdoor ceiling speakers for the most aesthetic options so far. Now these would sit under the soffits of your roof and wouldn't be noticeable unless you looked up towards the roof. For those projects that have a large enough soffit and want to benefit from great but discreet audio, weatherproof ceiling speakers are a great option. There's a couple of options here that would be great with the Sonos amp, like the Bowers & Wilkins Marine series starting from £420 a pair and the Monitor Audio AWC 265s for £500 a pair. They can be both left outside all year round, including their grills, and they won't rust or discolour even in a marine environment. The last wired option I want to discuss is the Sonance Patio Series, so I don't have that here, but it's a 4.1 system consisting of four speakers and one subwoofer, hence 4.1. The speakers are like spikes that are dug into the ground and they look a bit like outdoor spotlights so you wouldn't necessarily notice that they were speakers. Of course, as you'd be having four speakers plus a subwoofer that is buried in the ground, the sound is spread around the area more which is ideal for larger spaces and offers an ambient immersive experience. You'd still require an amplifier to power it and we find the Sonos amp is a great option but there is an option to power the system with Sonance's recommended amp, the SR2125 amp. In terms of pricing, you'd be looking at around £2,200 for the system with the Sonos amp or around £2,400 for Sonance's own amp. I would say that most of the permanent outdoor solutions are for those with a larger outdoor area. If you're in a more built-up housing estate with close neighbours, you might want to consider how loud you'd be wanting to go, as of course we can't be held responsible for angry neighbours at your door. Top tip, if you're having a party, just invite them round. That's one less angry neighbour for you. The next option offers a wireless solution, which is perfect for those 
those of you after a discrete audio solution. So the Lithe Audio Rock speaker available for £225 each or £335 for a stereo pair is exactly what the name suggests. A speaker designed to look like a rock and blend into your garden. Rock speakers in general require an amp connected via speaker cable, but the lithe option that I have here only requires mains power. From there you connect via Bluetooth and you're good to go. A single rock speaker would fill a medium sized space easily, while the stereo pair is great for larger spaces and you're obviously getting more performance per pound. I think you'll either love or hate the design of the rock speakers, but it's good to include as an option. Okay, let's move on to the final category for outdoor audio, and that's portable speakers. Now there are, of course, a huge range of options when it comes to portable audio, and it can get quite heated as people tend to have their favorites and stick with them, so don't come for me in the comments. We've kept it nice and simple for this video with our top affordable option, top two mid-range options, and our top speaker for bigger budgets. Starting off with our affordable favorite, we've got the new Sony SRS XB13 portable speaker available for 55 pounds. We've recently done a full review of this speaker on our channel, so you can check that out. But in a nutshell, we recently tested out this compact speaker and were so impressed with the sound this thing could produce. You've got the choice of six color options, a handy strap, a really strong IP67 rating to fare well with any weather and a rugged design for throwing in a bag and taking out and about. It offers a battery life of 16 hours, which is really quite good for a 55 pound speaker. It's more suitable for smaller gatherings, but you do have the option to create a stereo pair with two and you'd be getting a really impressive sound performance for just over hundred pounds. Moving on to our top mid-range options then. So we've picked our top two, but there are so many options that we could have highlighted. First and foremost, we've got the Sonos Roam, Sonos's smallest and most affordable portable speaker with a price tag of £159. We have got a full review of the Roam on our channel, but in a nutshell, it's Sonos's smallest and most affordable speaker to date, which offers the best of both worlds with both Bluetooth and Wi-Fi connectivity. It's a great addition for existing Sonos users to continue listening outdoors, or if you're new to Sonos and like the idea of building up a home full of audio that can all be centrally controlled, Sonos is the number one choice for multi room audio as voted by places like Watt Hi-Fi and Hi-Fi Choice. The Roam offers a range of features including voice control and a 12 hour battery life. I'll link our review below for more information. Our second mid-range speaker would be the Ultimate Ears UE Boom 3. So Ultimate Ears are well recognized at being right up there in the top brand of portable speakers with a range of speakers at multiple different price ranges. The Boom 3 has an RRP of 129 to 159 depending on the color that you go for. It can't become part of a home ecosystem like the Roam can, but it is an impressive portable speaker. My top features to highlight are the 360 degree sound, meaning, meaning it can fill a space well, and the very durable design and a 15 hour battery life. If you're looking for a more rugged option which can be dropped and thrown about, this is a great speaker to go for. It offers the same IP67 rating as the Roam, both are waterproof up to one meter for up to 30 minutes, but the Boom 3 will actually float. Our final option is for those looking for a more powerful portable solution and have a bigger budget to play with. The Sonos Move is the Roam's bigger brother and it can fill a larger space comfortably. It's not your typical portable speaker, it's not designed to be thrown in a bag and taken out and about, but rather become an extension of your home audio. With both Bluetooth and Wi-Fi connectivity, the Move can be part of your ecosystem at home and then switch to Bluetooth when you're in the garden or away from home. It offers an IP54 rating so it can uh, handle a bit of rain, um, an 11 hour battery life, voice control built in and more. Again, I'll link our review below for more. Now there are lots of other options, we'd of course be here for hours going through every single one. As always, leave a comment below if you want our opinion or would like a review of any products in particular. So I hope that's given you enough options to consider and helped you decide what solution would be best for your needs. I'll link everything we've mentioned today in the description including any reviews we've done as well. As I mentioned, do reach out if you want to have a chat, our team are always happy to help out. Make sure you subscribe for more and we'll catch you in the next video. Thanks for watching.